Hi guys, welcome to a new vlog. This vlog is the Cheer Live vlog. I don't know how much footage or I'm allowed to film in the show, but I'm so excited. I just can't wait. So I just wanna film, get some footage of the show and kind of like do a review. As you guys know, like I love the show, the Netflix series Cheer. And when I saw that they were going on live tour, I was like, I need to get some tickets. So got tickets. And now I'm gonna eat something before the show. It's at UCF, so it's like super convenient and not too far away. And I'm just really excited. So probably gonna get some Four Rivers tonight. I'm excited. I ate so much today because my boss brought in like these really good chocolate covered pretzels. <laughs> and then I had pizza because I had a meeting with our like general manager. Um, with a group of people it wasn't just me and we had pizza and then of course my boss like I saw some Doritos and he was like oh you can have some because like uh, some of the other guys that I work with have some uh, had some and I was like okay because like you guys know I love Doritos so yeah um today has been a good day been eating like all day now I'm gonna get some more food Guys, it has been forever since I've been in this Four Rivers. And I think this is the original one. Like, I don't know. I don't know though, but it's pretty big. Also too, guys, I wanted to show you my little outfit. I showed you my little outfit on Instagram. So make sure you follow me on Instagram if you're not. So I just got my usual mac and cheese fries and they actually like gave me like a lot of fries. And I also have this chicken. Okay, so I was joking around saying that I feel like I'm gonna be like the only adult here. <laughs> but because there's like so many like little kids like wanting to see a show obviously with their parents. So it's okay. I'm gonna enjoy myself and enjoy my time watching the show. But I just think it's so funny. So I feel like I'm just like so random to go to something like this, but I'm excited. I'm only here. I know that we are excited for the show. I know the cast is excited for the show. But are you guys excited for the show tonight? This whole process of putting together a live show has been a new experience for both of us because we are so used to building routines that, what, Andy? Score as many points as possible. <laughs> Yeah, you know it. 
know you have lots of options when you fly, and we're so glad you chose us. Please take your seats and direct your attention to the front of the plane as we take a moment to review the safety features of this aircraft. incorporate the audience a lot which I really like it's really entertaining um, some people think that there's like too much dance but like I don't think that because they still do like stunts and stuff so I think it's really good and I think it's a good balance I mean obviously you guys know like they probably need a break after like going full out for certain numbers and stuff I, I say numbers because that's like dance terminology but after they do their routine full out like obviously they need a break so like they have like little other things in the show and stuff so overall, I um, think it's a thumbs up. I would definitely go again. And I was sitting in like the perfect spot um, and there was like no one in front of us but these like little girls, but they were short, so it didn't really matter. But yeah, I just really, really like the show. If I think of anything else when I get home, I'll let you guys know, but I just wanna give my like official, sorry, there's like a cop car <laughs> right in front of me. Um, but thumbs up, 
It was a really good show. Okay guys, so it was really funny too because when we were crossing the street, the crossing guard was like, oh, where are the kids? And I was like, oh, I'm the kid. Like, I don't know. And then these girls behind me were like, why did he say where's the kids? It was like so funny. So I just remembered that. So I wanted to include it in this little vlog because I was just saying before we headed in that I was like, you know, I'm probably gonna be the only adult here, <laughs> but you know. It was good, it was good, but I just thought that was really funny. Okay, so I'm literally using my coffee to hold you guys up, stand you guys up, and I'm just filming this on my phone because all the other clips are on my phone, but I wanted to talk about a few things. So I wanted to talk about the duration of the show. It was a solid two hours, which I was surprised about. Like, my mom and I were thinking that it was probably gonna be shorter because, like, we didn't know what we were expecting. So I was thinking it would be, like, an hour and a half, roughly. Um, but like they went the full two hours and there was actually an intermission, which I was shocked about. Overall, I think you definitely get your money's worth of like a really good high quality performance. Um, their tumbling and scales were all like super clean. Um, now I'm not a cheer professional nor like know a lot of the terminology, but like because I danced and stuff, like I can tell, like anyone can tell if something's sloppy, but they were very clean and I loved all of the pieces, pieces. I loved all the routines and stuff. My favorite one though was definitely the airplane one where they were pretending like they were taking off, you know, fasten your seat belts and then they threw in like cheer terminology in that, in like the voiceover stuff and then they came out with these like the little wands for directing an airplane. I thought that was so cool and it was different. I really enjoyed that, that was my favorite. I also wanted to talk about really quick, um, I love the fact, and I was telling my mom this when I got home and everything, that I love cheer just because of the environment and that like everyone wears the same uniform and you're on like a team. I mean, dance is similar. I've mentioned this before, but I mean, in certain dances, there's different roles and like, it's not a bad thing because like it's a story you're telling and everything and everyone has to fill a role but like in cheer you know everyone wears the same uniform you're on the same team and you know everyone has to pull their weight just like in dance but still it's like you know if the bass or like the back spot doesn't do their job then like the whole stunt could fall down and I just I really like the sport and I wish that like if I could go back um, and cheer was the way it is today, that I would definitely cheer because I feel like I would excel in that sport. And that's probably why I've just become like such a cheer fan um, because I see a lot of cheerleaders more with like my body style and everything. And yeah, I just, I like the different levels. Like you gain skills, you go up levels, age groups and everything. With dance, it's just kind of like beginner, intermediate, and advanced at like competitions. But I like the, well, you have to be, you have to have a back handspring to be on level two. Like I like the rubric. It's a little bit more structured. And I get that cheer is definitely an objective sport but um, dance is more objective. Like it's more about opinion really for like the judges and stuff. I just like a little bit less objective. And yeah, like if they make a mistake, you can clearly see it. And if they don't, then you can clearly see it. Like I, I kind of like that. Maybe that's just my analytical side coming out. Okay, I just wanted to add this too. I'm in my work office space now, um, but I was so surprised there was no like mess ups in the show. There was one bobble, but like that was a two hour show guys and like no one messed up or if they did, like I didn't notice or realize it. So just found that to be like kind of crazy and yeah. I wish I could have cheered like back in the day, um, but I definitely know cheer isn't the way it was back in the day because it's come a long way, but still. Um, going back, um, I would have loved to like have that experience. I th think it would be like super cool. So probably if any of my, if I have kids eventually or whatever, definitely putting them in cheer because I don't know, I just really like the sport. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.